Yo, 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 yo! What is popping, everybody? Welcome back. This is Central Planning, the series in where I have to make sure my head is in a specific position as so that it is visible and not behind whatever I've got displayed on stream. So, I would like to talk about this, the weekly review! This is what I do! I talk about the week. If you're new here, I've gotten a lot of new followers this week, so what's popping? Welcome! This is, you know, I do a lot of stuff here, so I'm gonna, I got spit on my webcam. Hold the phone. Alright. I was, that gag, that visual gag was not even visible. I guess it was, I'm holding the phone. I have to make this explicitly clear. I'm holding the phone. So anyway, um, I would like to talk about my videos this week. Yeah, that's what I'm doing here. So, Doom, knee deep in Doom. I finished Sunlust. I've gotten some requests as to when that's going to be back. I'm going to do summer of 1969 starting tomorrow on Monday. So just, just for you know, just so you know. But I did finish Sunlust. If you like Doom, highly recommend you watch Sunlust, especially the last few levels because they're fucking wild. Um, yeah, the Liberty Loop. I would like to talk about that. That's been a lot of fun lately. <laughs> Every time I upload one of those videos, my channel is at the point now where it gets in the search engine optimization where right wingers will find the Liberty Loop and they will click on it and watch it and agree with everything I say unironically as if it's not a satire. Again, imagine watching like a 10 minute video that I do. And again, that's the thing. It's like, I can do this for 13 minutes, complete deadpan. So like, it's impressive. I, I just want to shout myself out that it is very impressive. Um, but go watch those if you want. They're, I think they're fucking hilarious. And of course the comments are starting to get really funny. Uh, definitely, definitely go watch. Uh, as far as above it all, um, I mean, I'll get into that as we go, because that's the main feature of the channel at this point. Uh, Path of the Exiles, a new series, uh, well, new season of that series is back. And I decided to twist it up a little bit, change things up a little bit. This league, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be getting extremely drunk every time I record these videos. And I'm just letting my heart explain the world. And so far, we've got the first five episodes up and... Uh, Go watch them if you want to learn a lot about me. Uh, needless to say, it's going to get to the point in the 70s where I start crying. And uh, there's going to be a lot of scoops. So if you're interested in that kind of stuff, I highly recommend you don't watch them sober. You're missing out on a lot of the experience. But either way, definitely go watch those. Uh, but yeah, as far as above it all goes, I mean, I you know post a lot of videos. It's hard to, to keep track. I would just recommend, again, if you see anything that looks interesting to you, to go watch it, you know, if you missed it, if it's a week ago. I try to make my content as untimely as possible, given the fact that it's a news channel. So, like, if I'm talking about, like, for example, in this video, this, this fucking candidate here, Dr. Winnie or whatever, I try to talk more about how deep fakes work and how, like, the right wing is going to use them as conspiracy theories and stuff. So I try not to just say, oh, this is my reaction to the news. I always try to give some sort of maybe grand message so if you see anything that sounds any, you know interesting or whatever one thing i've noticed is when i make these videos and these obscure right-wing candidates is i'm like the only video on youtube for a lot of these people and so the right-wingers like flock to those and it's always really interesting so if you ever see like another right-wing bizarro congressional candidate or something let me know and i will make like the only video about them and then i will get thousands of views and boomer ad revenue so i love it uh, there was an election this week, and that was actually pretty cool. Um, the Louisville, uh, Kentucky had one polling place and throughout the entire city. And that, the, that election, even though it was on Tuesday, is still being counted. So, I mean, I, you know, there's a lot of garbage there. Um, obviously, I mean, Trump is a fucking moron. Halo and Chill, re you know, returns for a third episode. I'm going to do a fourth one soon. That one I talked about, as you can see here. Fast food, nutrition, fat shaming, fat acceptance, and how broken the industry is in regards to health and food. Um, definitely something I'd recommend watching. Um, I got really mad at Obama this week. I made two videos just as an excuse to yell at him. This one here, if you want to see me go off the handle on Barack Obama, this one here. Barack Obama has the audacity to claim George W. Bush believed in the rule of law. Watch that if you want to know what my thoughts are on Barack Obama. Um, North Carolina, the state that I live in, has a mask mandate. So now when you leave the house, you need to wear a mask. Right-wingers now, the lieutenant governor, trying to sue him. Right-wingers have been posting petitions in my comment section. We gotta, we gotta impeach Roy Cooper for, you know, my freedom. And it's like, again, North Carolina is bizarre. I'm probably going to be doing more North Carolina content as I get more 
you know, as I learn more about the state, obviously I just moved here. So, I mean, there's a lot to learn, a lot to take on. But whenever there's North Carolina related news, you're going to see me talk about that. Maybe, you know, other states too, if I know something. Like, I know a little bit about Maryland since I lived there. So, I made some videos about Maryland. Um, also, this absolute brain genius behind the Reopen Maryland cause. So, I, you know, I know things about Maryland. I know a little bit about New Jersey. I grew up there, but I wasn't really into politics when I was a teenager. So, I don't know much about it. But, you know, I, I know some things about the machine. And, you know, I learned more about New York because that's a pretty active scene as well. So, but, you know, a lot of people cover New York. If you want to see New York, go watch another channel. But uh, I'm going to try to do more North Carolina related coverage. MAGA. Trump signs the border wall. I mean, there's, I made eight minutes of content there. There was only 40 seconds of content. I added eight minutes of extra content. So, I mean, again, if you want to see some stuff, go watch it. Uh, God Damn It came out. Another good app. Definitely a good show worth watching if you just want to chillax. Um, good show this week. I uploaded a spontaneous debate. And I took a day off. I think I took Thursday off. Just because, like... I got really drunk doing Path of the Exiles videos, and I just, you know, I woke up and I was like, eh. And then later that day, uh, I do have a Discord if you want to, you know, the link's on my website. So, scroll down, blah, blah, blah. But some dipshit entered my fucking Discord and was being as obnoxious as humanly possible. And as stupid as humanly possible. So, eventually, I just was like, alright, let's have a debate. Because that's the whole reason why I have stupid people in my Discord is, you know, so I can make videos like SJW is triggered by the dumbest debate in history. They claimed the debate had like two parts. The first 30 minutes was their claim was that leftists are anti-science. And then I asked them to define what a leftist is. And then 30 minutes later, I, ha I had no clue what their definition of a leftist was. The closest I got was Democrat liberal. So I, I don't know, but... And then the second half was about them saying that slavery is non-existent in the historical sense. It's definitely something to watch if you want to see me just... I got really mad. Like, I'm just going to say this. Like, if you want to see me scream and yell with righteous, you know, indignation, that's the video to watch. I screamed a lot to the point where, like, I walked downstairs later and my family was like, why are you screaming? I was like, oh, I was having a debate. And they're like, oh, okay. But, um... Definitely go watch that if you missed it. That's one of the one of the legends. Um, I hate Nancy Pelosi. This video here, 18-year-old black woman set on fire in Madison. Um, I did an update on that. And that's been like kind of this new right wing like hoax thing where like like I'm like the thing with the right is they say that like, oh, white people are begging for racist violence to talk about on YouTube. Yet, like, they only show up to, like, one individual story that I post. Like, I talk about racism on my channel literally every day. For whatever reason, it's only this vid- Like, these two videos about this story that's getting this- This right-wing mob attacking it. And claiming that I'm just reaching into the bottom of the barrel for racism. Why don't they do that on the rest of my videos, I wonder? I'm not sure. I think it's just because they're stupid and they just, like, oh- Alex Jones talked about this. Now I gotta go harass everyone on YouTube. Like, I think that's just one of those things. And they don't have any sort of brain. So they can't think, oh, maybe this person's talking about this. Maybe let's just go harass them on every video. It's like, I don't know. It's really bizarre. Uh, this video here, the Sacramento Karen. You love to see it. Make racists afraid again. Love it. This is another one of these bizarre congressional, can well, Senate candidates. And swearing an oath on the Bible to QAnon. Certainly not something I thought I would see, but makes perfect sense in the era that we live in. Um, I uploaded another episode of Cooking with the Bitch. I'm going to do a lot more of those. I've been talking a lot about food, like I did the Halo and Chill episode about food. I'm going to talk a lot more about that, and I want to teach you how to make a lot of food that's good for you and healthy for you. Um, that's also cheap, because I'm poor. I've been poor my whole life, except for maybe one year, debatably. One year of my life, I've been debatably lower middle class, but... For the majority of my life, I've been poor. And so I want to do... I'm a vegetarian, so that's going to be like, again... I want to do... I'm not like here to push the vegetarian agenda. I'm here to push the agenda of you being a healthy motherfucker. So I'm going to do a lot more of those videos. I'm going to teach you how to make a lot of things. Um, a lot of them may be the same. A lot of them... You know, it's just going to be like an avenue for me to cook and then talk about food and talk about a lot of stuff. So that's going to be something I'm going to bring back. I'm going to do a lot more of those. Um, I'm almost done Halo. And I'm going to get into Halo 2 soon, hopefully. 
So, the second to last video from uh, the Keys mission, that's up. And uh, as you can see, I'm still uploading some uh, some videos, so these don't have thumbnails yet. But, you know, again, hopefully you enjoyed this week's uh, content. I'll again tomorrow post the next week's schedule. Um, and, uh, yeah, so sorry if I've been waking up later. I've been experimenting with lucid dreaming a lot, and therefore I've been sleeping a lot more. So that's something I'll talk about in another video. But, again, thank you for watching. And if you see anything that you missed, or if you're new here and you want to scroll back a little bit, this is a good way. You can just go on my, my you know page here and just look at the videos themselves. But this is a good way to get a little roundup, get a little bit of tidbits about these videos. And, uh, again, I'll see you later. Thank you.